Anyway, this is my first time commentating Joker, and I have a lot of insights. So <laughs> let's get into this game one on Smashville. Pikachu versus Joker. Yeah, Pikachu definitely. And the he way does that he not moves, have a jump. <laughs> the way that he moves in general is just like and not he is something. Dead. He and he's dead. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so excited to commentate Joker. I have so much insight. I'm, the, I'm the Joker of this region. Ah! All right, nice dash but tech. Yeah, Joker's dash it's tech. Not, the rest of this game ain't going to go like that. Yeah. Light, 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 tech. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Joker's dash tech is absolutely crazy. It's a frame six option that is just like, it pretty much does everything you want. It's a phenomenal burst option. Nice, and nice. we got the... Ooh, we waited. I wonder why. Did he have a read on something, you think? You know what I think he's trying to do? I think he's trying to read escape options. Just like right. get a read on what his panic options are. Our Sen is online. Okay, I see a that hard read on neutral get up. It would have killed. Oh boy, would it have. Yeah. Oh yeah. Our sun forward smash. Hella strong. Yeah, that mm. was that was a That was a reaction, you can tell. That was fantastic. Yeah, that was very just drops with the Tetracarn. Drops the taunt as well. We're gonna see some neutral here. I wanna see light maybe employ some of the down guns more. I feel like Pikachu's type character, that was nice. The Pikachu's yep. type character that like the way he moves and the way he zooms around in neutral isn't really gonna get caught by a ha lot. Like I'm not gonna lie, unless he does it like from max distance with like Arsene or something and just tries to use his spacing tool, I feel like it's not, Pikachu's not the type character to like, that you're gonna be able to just click with that, you know what I mean? That's why I wanna see him use more um, down guns because that can yeah. be your zoning tool. It's lagless for, for the yeah. most part, so. Going for that the down air, the, uh, no, not really. It's actually quite safe. Yeah, that's true. But the reward off of it is, uh, it's amazing. Death right now. Yeah, uh, no, but a lot of damage. Down air up smash would not kill at this percent. I mean, it would now, but not at the percent he was at at the time. Yeah, was, I, don't like, I don't like his ledge game. Up, I feel like, like Joker's got such, like, Joker's got a lot of stuff. Like, I know that I've been saying a house probably not gonna hit Pichu, but at, or Pichu, excuse me, but at the ledge, like, you can at the very least apply pressure. I'd rather see him do that than yeah, just go for raw. That's like, nice. Aegeon is very safe at the ledge as well, so when you have Arsene, you, you know, you can throw out the Aegeon. Yeah. The least, even go for smaller punishes. Like, you don't need to mash an F, or hit an F smash to, like, the reward to is get just good very, damage. very big. Yeah, that's facts. Another F smash. That's just, I don't know, man. Greedy. Light's feeling it out, though. Yeah, that's true. All right, Arsene. Yeah, that's definitely light. For how early he died, stock one. Like, this is a lot closer than you did assume that they would go. You know, I've been saying about Joker, you beat him up enough, his dad comes. Yep, yep, that's <laughs> it. Great read. <laughs> him and his dad get spiked to the blast. So <laughs> and that was a good read on the air dodge. Light was actually going for that option a few times, but... Mostly grappling to the ledge. The one time he didn't, DM yeah, ready for it. And we are going to see DM Bam Battlefield and uh, Yoshi's Story, which I uh, firmly believe those are Joker's two worst stages. So I don't think that's a good idea. <laughs> but um, I got to say, I'm a big fan of the way um, the DM's playing this edge hurricane. Oh, yeah, like right there, we just saw him like he killed wait it out. Because you don't got to like, like one, he killed him at zero. Two, right there, he just waited and reacted because Pikachu's just got such a powerful, like, uh -huh. just a, a, in general, just ability to edge guard to the point where you don't yep. need to hard commit. And right there he didn't, and he got the win. So All right, we're seeing the see green that. headband Peach, Pikachu and the Persona 4 Joker going back at it. Matching colors, big fan. Here it comes. Yeah. Okay, we got the loops. Kind of drops him a little bit there, but does catch him out of his jump, and he is dead. Goodness me, both games. Yep. Like, like I kinda, said, man, DM's just so scary with his edge guard. Like kind of shook his head there. He, he, um, I think he thought that he could make it back with that grappling hook. Uh, I'm not gonna lie, I kinda thought he could too. I've seen that come from some uh, even the depth. Even the upward uh, boost of the first grappling hook that you use in the air isn't enough to make it back from that distance. Ooh. Nice, nice up tilt, starts great, a combo, great, great, great. and I would've liked to see an up the extension there maybe, uh, just to try and like tap him off the top a little bit. I respect that he didn't though, because Pikachu's like such a small target and he didn't want to get punished. Yeah, I don't, yeah, and he can fall fat, like he can quick tag down and stuff, so it's okay. That was yep. fantastic. That's mm -hmm. exactly what he needs. That's. I'm. I'm glad that we're starting to see shades of light. There's the down gun. Yes, down gun and the jab. Because like before, I felt like it wasn't like the game one. It didn't really feel like we were watching light. Like the lights, the same light that plays like you know, that parries every landing you see in an aerial as box. But right there, we definitely we saw a little bit of, a bit of uh, excuse me, of damage. a little bit of it return. I don't see light. Nice. Okay, I was just gonna say I don't see light go for back air that much in neutral. Um, it's very good an advantage for Joker, but 
D, I'm getting that read again. Get back air, and we're gonna see down tilt two frame. Nah. That was there's the right jump there. guns. Got him right where he wants him. Nah. Yeah. Trying to get that up smash, just a little, a little bit off. Ooh. One jab into a roll read F smash, no cigar. Yes. I don't know, I don't... Nice Rebels guard. I don't know if I like Light's use of just raw smashes so far, though. Like, I'm loving his role. use of Rebels guard. Oh, absolutely. He's doing it really good times. Like, all of his counter uses so far has been fantastic. Like, that's for facts. Nice wait. Yes, yeah, okay, like that. see, I like that's that a much a better, better option. Like yeah, yeah, yeah. Better. Dash tech is going to kill. Nice zone breaker right there. I like the way he's been using it. Yeah, he's using it how you're supposed to. Yeah. Uh, just a very fast frame six burst option, so. There's going to be a lot of damage, which equates to a lot of our send time being lost. Yeah. Now he's just keeping him under control right now. And a classic like Eha. Just to apply pressure. Yeah, That's disadvantage Eha. That's a little lingering hitbox of the downer. I just like DM's use of just safe stuff on the ledge. Like, just in safe stuff in general. Like, I remember back in Smash 4, he used to always go for just the raw up smashes, like taunt bait up smash and all that. But now he's just going for, like, the conservative stuff that works just as well. Yeah, nice. That was a great whip punish. Joker's dash grab actually quite bad. Again, like... Yeah, I was going to say, double jump read is probably what DM is going to go for here. Ooh. <laughs> a little curb the stop. There. Yeah, DM's basically in danger mode right now. Joker's at least got a little bit more until he's in danger of, like... Oh, okay, the invincibility on the um, Wings Water Rebellion yeah, does get him up. Right but DM with a it's neutral a get-up read. We're probably not going to see the Joker for game yeah, three. Yeah, odds are. You think we'll see the Falco or you think he's going to go Fox? I'd like to see the Fox. I think he's going to go Fox, Falco. Yeah, you're probably right. I mean, honestly, I, I think Falco might even be the better pick versus Pikachu. And Fox? <laughs> yeah. I mean, like, Fox Pikachu doesn't look very fun for the Fox. Does, Dia, does Fox Falco look very fun for the, for the Fox? For the Falco? God, I can't speak today. I apologize. Um... We'll see. Well, bada bing. Take that seven. seven. All right, so a lot of this um, for Light is going to be trying to get these grabs, trying to get yep. these up tilts. Um, Falco, obviously, kind of a heavy combo-based character. Oh, yeah. That's um, nice. And Pikachu, also a heavy combo-based character, but the way that Falco goes about it is very different. Yeah. Falco likes a lot of his like vertical launchers into mm. things, almost straight up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, like literally vertical. Yeah. Pikachu, kind of um, the opposite. He's a very horizontally based comboing character. Which you so. can argue is a lot more scary because you can get those edge guards where you can sand. Yeah. One thing that I, a big thing that I think separates Falco and um, Pikachu is just how much, like, generally. Oh, he got a new! He turned it the wrong way? Do you think that was a read? I think it. I think it might have been. I don't know. It's tough to say. Yeah. But in general, I feel like. A big thing that separates Falco from Pikachu is just that Pikachu's neutral is so much more airtight. Oh, Falco's neutral is nothing compared to Pikachu's, but Falco's oh, yeah. advantage is arguably better uh, in some ways, so... Light is making good nice, use of nice, that, nice. and Falco's advantage being very scary... I mean, Pikachu's nice, advantage nice. is incredible, don't get me wrong, but... Oh, yeah. These these conversions, they, they add up fast. Oh, goodness me, and wow. look at this! 90%. Like you said, just... I feel like he's definitely doing a much better job taking advantage of Pichu, Pikachu's just like pressure, like lack of instant pressure relief than he was with Joker. Because Joker's yeah. like, Joker's more of a scalpel, where Falco's like, like an unsharpened butcher knife. You know what I mean? Like, I'm not telling you I'm wrong. <laughs> yeah, you do need to play a lot more methodical with Joker, I feel, which um, I don't think complements nice, nice. Light's style as well as the Falco. Oh yeah, I agree. That's like, Falco's brazen, just like Fox. Yeah, I mean, you know. Just like Light. DM's kind of trying to hit him. Honestly, like, yeah, this is... I mean, you don't need us to say it, but it does look a lot better than the Joker did. Oh, yeah. A little bit. Falco's also definitely a character that's got more just, like, safe combo starters that he can toss out and catch the yeah, buttons with. Yeah, I mean... Which is, I think, a big factor. Sort, sort of, because Pikachu's forward air is, like, really safe. Oh, yeah. But, like, I guess, like, on the... 
I don't know. Like, he has a lot better... Nice frame job right there. Excellent work. He has a lot better combo starters after a defensive option. So, like, Falco, spot dodge, up tilt, roll, up tilt. You know, Pikachu yeah. doesn't have those combo starters unless he's airborne. Oh, I'm talking compared to Joker. Oh. Like, well, from Mike's perspective. Yes, like absolutely. Dude, he had to read, but Joker's, he, Oh, my goodness. Yeah, I just tracked them down. That Joker's was, combo starters compared to Falco's are just, like, fair one, uh, up throw, yeah. and down tilt. A lot of stuff that has either a lot more commitment or a lot more just like startup in general than just Falco standing there and up tilt and Pikachu when he trusts Pharaoh. Falco's up tilt's really good. That's a good like, move. <laughs> I, I would bet that a lot of the conversions that like got that game uh, were pretty much like those zero to sixties. They were all off up tilt. Oh, all of them, yeah. Because it's like there've been several videos made about that move alone, like and for yeah. good reason. You've seen it playing on display right here. That last kill was phenomenal as well. Like just yeah, tracking absolutely. down DM there. That's, this is what I was talking about when I'm saying just like I see more of light in this Falco than I did in yeah, the Joker. Yeah, it definitely fits him a lot more, I'd Honestly, say. Like, Got Mr. Ryan Ness waving to the crowd. <laughs> it was good. Let's go main. Who's got that Inkling plush so I can steal it? I don't know. Got some of the boys straight chilling. I see Palka in the back. <laughs> they, they're thinking hard about this counter pick. I mean, they're going man. to town, it looks like, but... They can't decide. Are they like, get me okay for something? Uh, who's up there? Oh, they're going to stadium. Who's that? Is that? Oh, that was Helper. Oh, okay, that'll do it, yeah. Okay, so there was some stream thing going on. Oh, okay. right. that, yeah, that makes yeah, sense. Yeah, yeah. It'd be like that sometimes. We, we let that happen. I wonder, I wonder if it was like, if he a was like asking if he can play this song. <laughs> Copyright. Dude, literally. <laughs> like, that's his jam, but like, mmm. <laughs> Dude. Man, I love music. This this uh, features... Ooh! Okay. Man, I love sets where the rest of... Where, like, ah. game four is completely different than game one. All in terms right. Of that's so good. Pokemon Trainer. DM secondary. Ooh. We're going to be seeing... Uh, I don't know, man. Did he, like... Lose faith in the Pikachu versus Falco? Like I don't after know. One he could have given it a shot, but I mean, I ain't complaining. I'd I, rather, I haven't seen okay. DM's Pokemon Trader in too long. I've been missing it. Okay, but real talk, mm -hmm. I'd rather bet this on the game four than the game five. I agree staunchly. Well, but do you need to bet it? Like, well, yeah, his Pikachu didn't really try it uh, or so, not yeah. bet it. But because yeah. he never switched off Squirtle, there he is actually going to eat a death very early. Yeah. Uh, I mean, Light's numbers are still completely white. Not looking great. Oh, yeah. but no damage on light right now. And the Charizard Why is, is he out. Because he wants he to go back to Squirtle. Squirtle. Because he's having a hard time getting his way in, I feel. With Ivysaur. He had a mad hard time getting his way in with Squirtle stock one. Damn, right? don't let this happen. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, let's go. Alright, now he's starting to get something going. We're talking a lot of mess, but I can, I can definitely see DM making this closer than it looks. Yeah, especially with these BNBs from uh from Squirtle nice. with coupled with the uh things that Ivysaur can do. Against Falco's, um, not particularly fantastic Ooh. neutral. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, he's dead. Yeah. yeah. Well, he was probably dead even if he had a jump. Let's be real. That's down air. That's down yeah, he did. Fear. He did actually double nice jump speed. into the. Uh, wow, that killed. He did actually double jump into the vine whip though. So. Oh yeah. yeah that was no resources. Wow, that goes straight under laser, huh? It's also got armor. Even if it got hit, it probably would just jump right through. Oh, I don't know. I don't know how that move works. It's kind of weird. You don't take damage in it. It's crazy. Really? Yeah. That's absurd. All right, these up throw conversions. You know, Squirtle known for these um, low percent B and Bs. Facts. Ooh, that was, I think he could up air there. Instead. I think he read a double jump. That's what happened. Nice, nice. No tip there. Oh, he's going to go, go for it again. again. Best blue. Nice. What a great that right chase there. down coming in from DM. Dude, this is what I like to see. DM fighting back. That was such a like good call out too because that is Falco's like primary escape option, just full hop away. And because he's got hops, he zooms. Nice, nice, nice. DM kind of putting the screws to him. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, this is Light's uh, winner's bracket stock actually. So that's facts. That's facts. That's true. This could be a bit nerve wracking if DM lets us get Ooh, out of like Light's that. control a little bit. 76%. This is the range for Del Thrumpy. Okay, no. Looking 85. For light. Yeah, light. Gonna need uh, to get an up tilt, but you're getting in grab range of Ivysaur. No thanks. Yeah, right. Double jump read? Nah. Yeah. Ooh, whoa. That was like the craziest. That was berserk. Ooh, light. Watch the Add a Shield. 
And that's going to clip. Yeah, that's going to clip him. <laughs> and DM is going to go into winter semis over lights. Falco and Joker. Man, I was just about to say, yeah, Light's got to watch out for the world. Look, what happened here? He just jumped, and then the up smash came through. He read, like, a jump out. Yeah, he, what did he do? It, mu it must have been a jump. Yeah, you're right. Or he might have grabbed? I don't know. We'll get the uh, slow down a little bit here. That, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah it yeah. was definitely a jump. Yeah. I mean, Fal yeah, that's just, I was just about to say, oh, yeah, Light should really watch out for just raw kill ops, because I feel like that's what DM's going to be fishing yeah. for, but... A few he seconds got him on too like late. the first frame of his jump squat too. Oh yeah, that like, was inst that looked like a shield poke. That sucks, <laughs> dude. I swear. Ooh, this is gonna be an interesting set. Who we got? 